Hey guys, welcome to my channel, Life of Lev. Today we're going to be talking about exporting your movie in 4K through iMovie. Obviously you're here because you have some sort of issue with exporting in 4K, or maybe you don't think it's possible, or maybe you just want to troubleshoot um, some way so that you can export in 4K and you've tried everything and nothing works. Uh, well, hopefully my solutions will fix it for you. So the first thing I'll say is that I had some issues with exporting in 4K and this might sound like a really crazy and dumb reason, but I didn't have the latest update for my Mac OS. And so I was on Catalina 10.15.3 and I tried everything. I had all my footage at 4K, um, you know, and I tried all the other solutions that I'm going to be showing you just in case you don't have the latest OS and, and these things might work for you. Um, but nothing was working for me. And all I did after searching around on the internet was I just updated my Mac OS to 10.15.4 and then everything worked. Uh, everything ran smooth and I was able to export at 4K. So the first thing I would say is if you can update your OS uh, updated to the latest OS and right now it's at 10.15.4. So the next thing I'm going to show you is I have a file for you to use that you guys can download. I have the link below. You guys can just download that and drag it into your project file and then you'll be able to export in 4K. So hopefully the solution works for you. So let's do that right now. So I'm going to launch iMovie and then you can see you have your projects here. What you want to do is actually create a new project. New project. Perfect. You got nothing in there. And the first thing you want to do is download my file and it's called 4K Life of Lev Movie Fix. So once you're done downloading the file, import the media. So I'm going to click on import media and then I'm going to go to desktop and I have my file on my desktop right now. So remember that the file is called 4k life of Lev iMovie fix. I'm going to click on that, import it. And then all you want to do is drag the file down into your timeline and perfect. So now that you have it in your timeline, you should be able to see that you can now export in 4K. So what I really did was I just set the standard for my project to be 4K. So now you can actually import your other media files and they might not be 4K, they might be 1080p, but you will be able to export that in 4K and you can delete my file, so my Life of Lev file. So let me walk you guys through bringing in a file and then being able to export your own movie in 4K. So right now you guys can see that my movie is in 4K thanks to my file, um, thanks to my movie file, Life of Lev. Um, so now what I want to do is I have a, I think this is a 720 movie, um, movie file. Uh, so you can see over here, it's 1280 by 720. And what I want to do is just import that into here. That's great. And then I want to pull it into my timeline. You can still see that our project setting is at 4K. But obviously, you don't want this life of Lev in there. So let's go ahead and I'm just going to hit the delete key to delete it. Now let's check our settings again. It's still at 4K. So now what's happening is um, I can still export my movie. That's That was a 720p movie, um, but I can export in 4K. So I can do that. We can test that out right here. Go to File. And you can see the resolution is at 4K. And you should be able to export it. So you can click Next. And I'll just call it my movie three. It's going to my downloads folder. Now say that solution doesn't work. I have another solution. So go ahead and close your iMovie. And then 
right before you launch it again, hold down the Option and Command keys, and then launch iMovie by clicking on it. And you're going to get a dialog box just like this. And it says, do you want to delete the preferences? Deleting the preferences will reset all application settings to their default. Libraries documents will not be affected. That just means your movies won't be affected, but your preferences will be deleted. So you can go ahead and delete the preferences. Perfect. And so it's pretty much like you were starting iMovie right from the beginning. Um, so you can go ahead and click on continue, get started, and then you can start the whole process just like how I've first shown you. So you can cr create a new project. Don't open up an old one, create a new project. And then download the um, Life of Lev 4K movie file fix and just again, just import it into your projects folder. So I'll do that right now. Import selected. And then pull it in to your timeline. And you should be able to export into 4K. So that's it, guys. I hope that really helped. It took me a long time to figure out why and how it wasn't exporting into 4K. I tried everything and I spent so many hours um, just really trying to figure everything out. And really when it came down to it, it was my Mac OS was not updated to the latest OS, which doesn't make any sense to me and why that's preventing my iMovie from you know exporting in 4K, but that was my biggest issue. But I've also seen issues with, uh, with other people where uh, my second and third um, fixes were able to help other people. So I just wanted to publish this video and I really hope it helps you guys out. If you guys need anything, please comment below and I'll try to help you guys out. Please smash that like button and subscribe to me. It would help me tremendously. I really hope that this fix has helped you guys. Subscribe, like, and leave some comments below. Thanks. See you next time.